What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and today we're going over the PlayStation 4, PlayStation Store deals and offers of the week for the EU side of things. Starting it off, we got the double discounts. Let's go ahead and jump right into it because we saw the US's double discounts and I'm kind of curious to see what the EU has to offer. Now keep in mind, with PlayStation Plus you get to save even more. So definitely take advantage of it if you guys see some of your favorite game franchises. Now, if you guys do enjoy these videos, make sure to hit a like, comment down below, let me know what you guys honestly think. I think it's pretty cool. So far, I've seen some pretty good games. Um, now, Conan Exiles was free on the PlayStation Plus if you didn't get a chance to pick it up. I, I mean, you would maybe pass on that one. <laughs> I like to keep it real with you. Batman Arkham Collection is on sale as well as Wolfenstein 2. Uh, probably the top two uh, games uh, that we've seen so far. I mean, Assassin's Creed is always a great time and I love it. In fact, Assassin's Creed 2 is uh, when I first fell in love with like trophy hunting. So um, I definitely do recommend it. But out of the games that we've seen just off the top of the list, Batman Arkham Collection is a great price as well as Wolfenstein 2 The New Colossus. Now, um, just be aware that in, you know, just be advised that Wolfenstein 2 is a heavily adult themed game um that's why i love it so much <laughs> we got the maddens on sale we we're gonna have sports games on sale for the next couple of weeks even months so just uh you know take advantage of it if you want i i don't know um you know the deals aren't that great madden nfl um 19 35 99 i don't know i don't know but we have star wars battlefront 2 which is on sale for 13.99 they're still supporting the game and they're still putting out new content so just keep that in mind i know that a lot of the the fans um have kind of fallen off on this one but, um, you know, there, there's still a lot of people that play it to this day and there's new content getting pumped out. So for $13.99, it's actually not a bad price. For Honor is on sale as well. We get some Lego games up in here, up in here. Do you guys play video, uh, like the Lego video games? Let me know in those comments down below. We Happy Few is a great time. Definitely do recommend it. It's on sale right now. So, you know, I don't know how, how much longer... We're going to see sales for We Happy Few um, for the foreseeable future. So um, if you guys are planning on taking advantage of this one, I'll probably take advantage of it like now um, or, you know, just wait. Just wait, uh, you know, a month later. Um, if you guys have other games, then by all means. We have Titanfall 2 Ultimate Edition for $16.24. We've seen this go for less, but it's still a great price, especially considering the fact you get the Ultimate Edition. Um, I would recommend it over the Standard Edition anyways. We got the Gold Edition of Trials Rising. Trials Rising is a great time. It's, a, you know, a fun game if you guys are into, you know, uh, motorcycles and things things like that and a bunch of trickster stuff then it's a great time nba live 19 guarantee this price is going to get slashed down even more so probably pass on that one unless you like really need a basketball game um by all means go for it but we're probably going to see that price drop dramatically as well just a reminder for everyone watching this video, this is the EU side of things. Don't get that confused with the US. The US has different offers that are available. And honestly, like the US has more games on the double discounts. But nevertheless, they do have some bangers here on the EU side of things. We got the totally digital sale, uh, which we have honestly gone over last week there's not too much that has changed so i'm not going to spend too much time in here i just want to show you some of the games off the top of the list and yeah that i'm i'm telling you guys there's not too many uh things that have changed with that one but nevertheless you guys want to see it so i show it to you guys games under 13 now games under th 13 are you know s some of the games uh we've seen before this game right here that i'm pointing at uh you know don't waste your time or money on it to be completely honest with you i get it um you know for free from a game developer and uh he, he, you know it's 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 a mediocre time uh you're not gonna have that much uh you know fun with the game um as much as you you think you would because it looks fun and quirky um and it is don't get me wrong it is but it's one of those games that you kind of like play in between games or you're waiting for your friend to get online and you you might jump on that and spend some time on it um but it's not something that you're gonna really stick your stick your teeth into 
Uh, nevertheless, let's go ahead and back out of here. The deal of the week is Need for Speed Payback, $9.99 for that. And then we got the uh, Deluxe Edition woo -woo, for $14.99. That's actually pretty cool. Um, there is a save up to 20% on PlayStation Plus and you get 10 gold bars, straight bars uh, per month. Uh, so 10 gold bars per month for Red Dead Online. That's a PlayStation Plus special right there. I want to click on it really quickly to see like, you know, how much it costs. So for 12 months, it's $39.99. For three months, it's $16.99. So 20% off, definitely take advantage of it. And keep in mind, PlayStation Plus does stack. So you will be able to, uh, you know, purchase this now, even if your subscription has not expired, it stacks. So if you have 11 months left to go on PlayStation Plus, you buy another 12 months, boom, you got what? I can't do math. Do math for me in those comments. 23 months? <laughs> Don't quote me on that. I'm pretty sure though. Totally digital games under 13. We get games under four, which I'm going to browse through very quickly. Tennis in the face is a great time. I don't know why it's not showing the price. Don't oh, PlayStation, why you do this to me? So I guess you got to choose a version of the game. <laughs> Very interesting. Never seen, you know, uh, me have to do this. Um, so the full game and you have a free trial. So recommend trying the free trial. This is more of like uh, a mobile game type of thing, but it's a lot of fun. And if you have friends over, it's one of those games that you can play with friends like in between games and just ha laugh and have a good time. King Oddball is another one that, that you guys can actually take it advantage of these both are on playstation now um and i'm pretty sure that king oddball has a free trial on it as well let's continue browsing through the list now nightmares um some of those games are uh, considerably easy platinums but they do have a lot involved with them so i wouldn't personally consider them that easy because you will have to spend a good amount of time on them and some of the trophies are a little bit tricky if you're not going uh you know step by step through a trophy guide which honestly like when you're playing a game it's not as fun you know to experience the game you know firsthand uh, compared to you know it's not that fun playing it um following a guide like step by step but for this game if you want to platinum easy you got to do step by step so just throwing that out there i'm not sure which one has the platinum so don't quote me on that one either i know somebody's going to be in the comments like oh this one doesn't have a platinum one of them does <laughs> so just throwing that out there metroid uh these games are awesome definitely do recommend it they're both on playstation now but you can purchase it too for 75 percent off are they going to make us choose a version? There's a free demo of it too. So this game is $3.99. Holy cow. That's a banger of a price if you ask me. Uh, Lords of the Fallen is kind of a, you know, kind of goes hand in hand with the, th those games as well as like Murder Soul Suspect. A lot of people pass on those games. They're, they're great games. Don't get me wrong. They are really good games, um, but they're not like a fan favorite or, you know, the PlayStation community's favorite, uh, to say the least. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys so much for watching this video. That's going to conclude the deals and offers of the week for the EU side of things. I'd love to know. Are you guys going to be purchasing anything? Let us all know in those comments down below, or if you guys have any recommendations, those are always welcome. They help, you know, our fellow community members uh, try to find a new game that they might love and enjoy and play for a very long time. So thank you guys so much for the continued support, and I will see you guys in the next news update. You guys are freaking awesome.